The Shenyang J31, also known as the FC31 Jurfalcon in its export version, has undergone significant development by 2026. Initially introduced as a stealth fighter demonstrator by China's Shenyang Aircraft Corporation, the aircraft evolved into a serious contender in the fifth-generation fighter category. Though not officially adopted by the Chinese People's Liberation Army Air Force PLOF in its earliest form, the design was reworked into what is now known as the J-35, a carrier-based variant specifically developed for the Chinese Navy. Over the last few years, China has been advancing both the naval J-35 and a renewed version of the land-based FC-31, with notable differences such as reinforced landing gear for carrier operations, folding wings, and catapult launch capability distinguishing the two. By 2026, the FC-31 project has gained new momentum, particularly in the international market. Pakistan has emerged as the first confirmed customer for the FC-31, with reports indicating an order of 30 to 40 units. Pakistani pilots began training on the aircraft in China in 2024, signaling serious commitment and operational preparation. Deliveries were scheduled to begin by late 2025 and continue through 2026 and beyond. The acquisition is considered a strategic move by Pakistan to counter India's air superiority assets like the Rafale, and potentially even prepare for a regional technological leap by introducing a fifth-generation platform into its air force. The aircraft will reportedly be designated as J-35A in Pakistani service, although technically it is an FC-31 variant. In terms of capability, the FC-31 is expected to be equipped with advanced WS-19 engines, offering around 12 tons of thrust and enabling speeds up to Mach 1.8. These engines may also allow for supercruise capability. The aircraft features internal weapon bays for reduced radar cross-section and will likely field China's most advanced air-to-air -air missiles such as the Place 15 and the ultra-long-range Place 17, which has a reported range of up to 400 kilometers. With AESA radar, sensor fusion, and modern electronic warfare systems, the FC-31 is aiming to rival Western platforms such as the F-35 in terms of battlefield awareness and stealth, albeit likely at a lower overall cost. The estimated unit price hovers around 70 million US dollars, making it an attractive option for nations seeking advanced capability without the restrictions of Western export controls. Production is expected to ramp up through 2026 with projections of around 30 aircraft per year. The land-based version, originally thought to be sidelined in favor of the naval J-35, now appears to be undergoing renewed interest, possibly as a next step in expanding China's fifth-generation capabilities beyond its carriers. The design and capability continue to be shrouded in secrecy, with many critical systems still not independently verified, but enough is known to suggest the FC-31 is a serious leap forward in Chinese aerospace capability. For countries like Pakistan, its induction could reshape air power dynamics in South Asia, potentially giving it a technological edge for the first time in decades. As of 2026, the FC-31 is transitioning from a long-running prototype into an operational, export-ready fighter jet that represents China's growing confidence and capability in the global defense market.